I'm going to be showing you how to create some adorable DIY ornaments using some old scrap wood. So just cut down your scrap wood to the size that you would like. First, I am using some brown acrylic paint and just using a baby wipe to apply that on. This is just going to leave you with a wood stained look without using any of those harsh chemicals that are inside of wood stain. And then just going over that brown paint once it's dry with this Waverly chalk paint in the color plaster. And I just kind of did this so that way some of that brown is still kind of peeking through just to make it look a little bit more weathered. Go ahead and grab a piece of fabric of your choice. I got this fabric from Dollar Tree. Just measure it around the, uh, the piece of scrap wood and then cut it down to size, and then just begin hot gluing that on the front, and then just flip it around and hot glue it onto the back. And just make sure that when you cut down your fabric, just make sure that you have enough on the top to create a hat out of it. So all I'm doing is grabbing a piece of string, just tying it off at the top, and now this just creates a cute little hat. And then I got this mop head from Dollar Tree as well. I'm just going to trace it out along the width of the block and then just cutting it down with a box cutter. And I'm just going to be using this for the white fluffy part of the hat. So just go ahead and hot glue that right down as well. And don't forget to hot glue those sides down as well. And look at how cute this is coming out. Next, you wanna just grab some black and orange acrylic paint and just start painting in a snowman's face. So obviously I use the black for the eyes and the mouth and then just use the orange for the nose. <laughs> And look at how adorable he came out. All right, for the next one, again, just cut down a piece of scrap wood. And then you could use faux fur for this part, but I decided to do something a little bit different. So I just grabbed a mop head from Dollar Tree, just kind of measured out how long I wanted the strands to be and just began cutting those down. And then all you wanna do is just start hot gluing the strands right onto the piece of wood. And then I just began untangling each of the strands. This is just going to make the mop head just a little bit more fuller and look just a little bit more realistic like a beard. And once you have all of those unraveled, go ahead and just cut down any excess along the bottom. Then I had this leftover Santa's hat. I believe this came from Dollar Tree last year. So again, just measured it out, cut it down to size, and then just began hot gluing that right on top. And just make sure you flip it around and hot glue those pieces along the back side. And then I also just added some hot glue along the top portion of the hat, just so those pieces stayed together. And I wanted the hat to lean on a certain side, so I just added some hot glue and then just moved the hat over to the side that I wanted it to be at. And then for the tip of the hat, just hot glue down a white pom-pom or cotton ball and then used one of these half wooden beads that came from Amazon and just hot glue that right underneath the hat for the nose. And then you wanna just tie off some string. This is going to be used as the hanger. Go ahead and hot glue and staple. If you have a staple gun, you can use that as well. And there you go, guys. Now you just created your own DIY ornaments and I literally made these for super duper cheap and they just came out so cute and it's just so happy to know that you created this yourself i hope this inspires you guys to create your own in your own special way if it did please be sure to sprinkle the love thank you so so much and i hope y'all have a good rest of your day thanks bye